What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Salty Turtle Entertainment. Moving right along, we got the Cast Reef puzzle. This box looks a little different than all the other ones. There's two other boxes that look like this one. The rest all have that like green and white puzzle box, but they are all part of the same bundle. They're still the same premise. Take it apart, put it back together. The back of this one says, in the summer of 1997, when I was one year old. I saw two mackerels that had somehow managed to get into the sardine tank at the aquarium. Watching these two fish, unable to blend in with the shoal of sardines, made me wonder if they were on a journey of self-discovery. What sort of adventures will they have? Imagining this led to the conception of six cast puzzles based on oceanographic subjects. Subject, reef. A pair of gobies living in a coral reef. Separate them from the coral, then put them back together again. Yamamoto 2008. I would assume Yamamoto 2008 means designed by Yamamoto, the same guy that did the Dolce from the last video, but I don't really know. I this I think this one looks really cool. This one looks really pretty with we got the fish tangled in the reef in there, and I'm really excited to solve this one. So, let's just take it out of the box, check it out and see what we got. I feel like this one looks like it could either be really easy or a pain in the ass. So, let's find out which one it is today. Is it gonna be a breeze, or is my ass gonna hurt? All right, after about half an hour of taking that apart. So remember this configuration, because this is how, this is 100% back to the start. So with the fish caught in the reef now where to even begin. I will get the timer out. Because I don't even know how to start this. There is, oh, here we go. Here we go, here we go. And we're off to the races. Okay, so move one, boom, boom. Oh, wait a minute. Aha. Okay. Now are we making more? Yeah. Ha. Oh. Oh. Okay. It's all coming together now. I see the light. Yep, that's what I want. Can we do it? Can we do it? Oh my god, it's so close. It's literally right there. Oh my god, I'm so close I can taste it. I, I can literally cook these fish and taste it. That's how close I am. I am so close to having a nice seafood dinner. It's not even funny, and I don't even like seafood. But I'm so close to eating a seafood dinner. I don't even know if I'm getting any of this on camera, cause like, this is, this this moves very precisely in a way that I need to be able to see everything that's going on. So, like, all these little nubs and extra protrusions stick out in just the right way, and they're so perfectly aligned with the fish. I really like this one. Damn, I was cruising for a minute there, but I'm stuck right at the very top. These face the wrong way. This bottom part would fit through this bottom part here if it was flipped. But how do I flip it? Look at that. Literally, if this was facing the other way, it would fit. But I can't flip it. Oh, son of Poseidon. There's gotta, there's gotta be a space somewhere that would allow me to flip my filet of fish but I can't. Oh, SpongeBob. Why? In my stick. I was doing so well. And then I started going backwards and now I'm stuck. Oh, nope, there we go. Now back to where we were. I don't, I don't think it wants you to flip the fish though. Cause I don't think there's any position where that's possible. Get all the way up to here. Now what? Oh, 
Oh. Oh. Ooh, new moves. Okay. Oh, I'm so good at these. Oh, that one was so fun, too. I had a good time maneuvering this one. Let's see if we can maneuver it back. Take that as a no. Come on, that went through perfectly. Why not anymore? Why not now? Like, that, that. Correct me if I'm wrong, but. I did bring the fish back through here, right? I. I. I, <laughs> I wouldn't mind it, but I know that's what I did. Because if I turn them around and the heads are in there. I literally can't do anything with them. I can't flip it around because there's only one orientation that works. It's this way. Because the neck comes all the way down. What if I go fishing? What if I toss a line out and give them the bait? Then then will they go? I wasn't bugging when the fish came back through that way, right? That, that like that was real. Oh, there we go. There we go. Why the f was that such a in the ass. What am I missing here? What what step am I forgetting? I, I really I really don't know. So what I'm stuck on right now. The fish need to be flipped cuz there's a little cutout right there. That this nub right here should, on the reef would be able to fit through. But I don't know how to flip the fish. Like I don't, I don't get how I did that. I just want to watch the footage back just to see if this is even in the right orientation. Hold up. I may have done this backwards. Aha, there we go. Yep, I had it backwards the whole time. And that's why it wouldn't go back together. So... Something. I am so... Something. Jesus f***ing Christ. <laughs> oh man. Who would have thought I could be so smart and so stupid at the same time? We did the damn thing, we freed the damn fish, and then we put the damn fish back. I honestly probably could have shaved a good 10 minutes off of the solve time of this if I was smarter and realized that I had the fish in the wrong orientation long before I finally decided to go back and rewatch the footage and figure out at that point that everything was backwards. <laughs> Brain fart moment aside, I still really enjoyed this puzzle. This is honestly one of my favorite puzzles from the bundle that we've solved so far. I love the design of it, I love how it moves, I love the preciseness of it. It's honestly so intricate that it's beautiful. 
it's it's poetic. The way the way it moved felt poetic. I, I don't know why I'm so enthralled with this puzzle in particular, but I really am. I love this puzzle. But I think that that's enough of me going on and on about this. If you watched all the way through, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Hit that bell notification so you know when all my videos go live. And now about do it for now. I'll catch you guys in the next video. I really feel like I missed a lot of opportunities for fish puns in this video. And I'm kind of disappointed in myself for that.